Hey everyone, my name is Grace and I'm a product manager here at Paka. Today we are diving into options trading, starting with cover calls. A cover call involves selling a call option against a long stock position. A cover call is a popular strategy where an investor holds a long position in an asset like stocks and then sells call options on the same asset. Investors often use cover calls to earn income from selling the call options while keeping the potential benefit from any moderate increases in the stock's price. In this video, I'll show you how you can easily execute a cover call using Alpaca's Python SDK Alpaca Pi. We have also included links to helpful resources like documentation and sample codes to jumpstart your options trading journey in this video description. Let's get into it. Step 1. Create an Alpaca account and retrieve your API keys. Head over to our website at alpaca.markets and click sign up for trading APIs. Once you're signed up, navigate to the account dashboard and if you scroll down, you're able to retrieve your own API keys from here. As you can see at the top, the API keys generated are for your paper trading accounts. Now that you have created an Alpaca account and retrieved the API keys, Let's set up Alpaca Pi. We'll be using paper environment for this example, so set papers to true. We'll install the latest Alpaca Pi using pip install and also import the necessary modules for this example. In this step, we're setting up your trading client using the API keys. We'll also fetch your account details to check the buying power as well as options trading level. Here you can see that my buying power for my paper account is $200,000 and I'm approved for options level 2. Here we're using the stock historical data client to fetch the historical data for stocks. And in this example, we're getting the latest quotes for SPY. As you can see that the latest quote for SPY is $540.91 on the bid and $540.95 on the offer. Now that we know the market for SPY, we're going to place an order to buy 100 shares of SPY. In this example, I'm going to place a market order. So the symbol is SPY, quantity 100, side is a buy, and the type is a market order. We're going to place it. Now the order is placed, but we can also check the status of our orders by using get orders request. Here we can see that we have a hundred of SPY filled at $540 and 45 cents. In this step, we're fetching a list of option contracts for a given underlying symbol. It's SPY in this example, and we're specifying parameters such as expiration date to be the exact date, but you could also use a range of dates. The type of contract is going to be a call option with a strike price greater than $550. Let's run this. Now we can see a list of option contracts that fall into the parameters that we specified here. Now I'm going to sell the first option contracts that return from our search. I'm going to use the symbol and place a market order to sell one call option. Remember that one call option typically represents a hundred of underlying shares. That's why we're going to sell this one call option. Let's run this. Now our order is placed. Now in this final step, we're going to get all our positions to verify that we have successfully placed a cover call. Let's run this. And we can see that we have 100 shares of SPY and we have sold a call option on SPY. And that's it. You'll learn how to execute and manage a SPY cover call using Alpaca's API. Now it's your turn to put this into practice. Sign up for Alpaca account today and get your API keys and start trading options.